one half mile. Turn right on Southwest to Aladdin Sherwood Road. If you say so. Alrighty. Alrighty, Aphrodite. So. Let's see here. So, what's going on now? Shit. Uh, well, it's still Friday. Uh, it's still August. And it's still the 21st. Uh, however, the time has changed. Huh. The time has indeed changed. Let's see. It's about uh, oh, 6.50ish in the p.m. Uh, current temperature outside is 81 degrees and I am in the town of, let me see, Tual Tualatin, tu tu Tualatin, Tualatin, Oregon. And you see all those little Amazon Prime trucks heading on into work? <laughs> yes indeed, that can only mean one thing, that I'm just leaving an Amazon, uh, heading away from work. So. Um, I know Turn she's, right there she on goes. Southwest to Aladdin Sherwood Road. Right on cue. I love you, Sheila. So I had a canceled load, which was going to be carting me down back to Medford from Hillsboro again for a third night in a row. Um, and it got canceled, and so it kind of changed some things around and made things a little goofy. For me. Um, In two and a quarter miles, take the ramp on the right to I 5 South toward Salem. Because my uh, my uh, agenda for the next you know two days up in, into Sunday was going to be run down to Medford, deliver that load, run back up to. Oh, I guess back here to Tualatin with an empty trailer, get it loaded, drive that on up to Kent, and that would have been tomorrow. You know, that would have basically, so I would have been in Medford tonight, spent the night, got up in Medford, drove from here to Tualatin, then from Tualatin up to Kent, and then spent the night, and then on Sunday, uh, brought the load from Kent back down to Hillsboro, and my and my basically my dispatch would have finished there. Um, but since that load got canceled, uh, everything else is the same, except for I'm not going down to Medford. So basically, I got you know just under 24 hours to kill. I have whatever 21 hours to kill. Because uh, this uh, load from Tualatin isn't going to be ready to, to ship out until 4:30 tomorrow, so so I basically I have until then to uh, to go poke around uh, the local towns and cities here in Oregon. <laughs> of course, I did see that top golf place. And I did see that indoor go-kart facility. But of course, I don't necessarily feel like driving back to Hillsboro because the traffic is kind of wicked. And honestly, I wouldn't mind just kind of hanging out on the bunk and watching a couple movies and resting up a little bit. I mean, that doesn't hurt my feelings too much. I, I was, you know, I, you know, I don't think I was necessarily looking forward to going In back three down quarters to of a mile, tonight. Take the ramp on the right to I-5 South toward but it, Salem. But it was something to do, of course. <laughs> you know, I, I don't mind it. I do not mind that run at all. It's a nice freaking run. Like I said the other day, as far as dedicated runs can go, I could do worse. But uh, that's not gonna happen tonight. So, so be it, whatever. I don't know, maybe I can call the boss and have them see if there's something lo otherwise local to do for because I still have on my clock a couple few hours to um, 
that I could have for driving. Let me see. What do I have left for driving tonight? Yeah, I mean, I still have almost five hours worth of drive left for today's shift. So, I don't know. I don't know if that's something that he could do while I'm already um, while I'm already committed to uh, tomorrow's loads. I don't know if he does or not. But anyways, whatever. It is what it is. So right now I'm heading over to the TA in Aurora again. Aurora again. And uh, for the time being, I'll head over there and hang out, maybe get a shower. I don't need to do any laundry yet. But, uh, yeah, I can at least go get a shower. Whatever. I'll find parking. <laughs> it's early enough, I'll find parking. That's, that's a good thing. Boy, when it gets late, I'm telling you, you know, when, when it gets, you know, 11 p.m., you know, to, you know, to 1 or 2 a.m., just forget about finding parking at those places. That's packed. You know, I got lucky, I think, last night. I don't know. I mean, we can always park on an off-ramp or on the side of a road somewhere or whatever or at a rest stop. That's, that's all perfectly acceptable and legit. It kind of leaves you hanging as far as, you know, being able to use a restroom or get coffee in the morning first thing, which is kind of usually, I don't know, kind of like my routine. I kind of need that. Take the ramp on the right to I-5 South kind of need toward that coffee Salem. Right when I get up. I guess I don't need it, but it sure does make things easier. So anyways, I got, uh, let's see, about 13 minutes to get to Aurora. Oh, wow, that was horrible, y'all. Oh, I'm gonna have to edit that out. I must have, I must have passed a gear up or something. Continue on I-5. Sitting there blabbering.
time.